And that event starting right now. You can see the crowd here behind me. I spoke to organizers who tell me they picked this location here where Janavi Kandula was killed eight months ago for a specific reason. They say they want to be here so everybody knows the exact reason they are fighting for this action. But she is dead. <laughs> They don't have any concern for the fact that this happened. They don't care about us, the citizens. They're supposed to be the ones protecting us, but they're not. This body cam footage of Officer Daniel Otterer has now been seen by people across the world. Local leaders addressing the disturbing footage. Seattle City Council Member Lisa Herbold calling it inhumane. Council Member Tammy Morales calling it abhorrent. One local activist saying, it's not surprising. I don't understand how anybody can look at that and say that this system is working. Ray Mitchell is a member of the Seattle Alliance Against Racist and Political Repression, the group organizing the demonstration. It's heartbreaking reading about her, reading about her family, reading about what her family's had to say about this. Miles away, they had no way to protect her, and they just find out their daughter was just killed, just like that, by an officer going three times the speed limit. Mitchell tells me their goal is simple consequences for every member of the Seattle Police Department connected to this incident. It's not acceptable. We, we want them fired and we want the first officer convicted. At this point, several agencies within the city have put out a statement in regards to this situation. However, they tell us they can't comment further because of the investigation. I have reached out to the police union several times over the last few days who have not responded. Now, Fox 13 has learned that Otterer self-reported these comments as well as that other employee who reported this incident. Now, as we learn more about this situation that continues to break over the week, we will keep you up to date. Reporting live in Seattle, I'm AJ Janival for Fox 13 News.